Thank you. In our HealthCast today, research is underway into a process that could lead to what some are calling a cure, a possible cure for type 1 diabetes. Dr. Camillo Ricordi with U Health is part of a multi-center investigation involving cell transplantation that could be done without the need for immunosuppressing anti-rejection drugs. Now, healthy isolate cells allow the pancreas to produce insulin. So this could be a quantum leap or the holy grail for islet transplantation in diabetes because if you use anti-rejection drugs you have to limit this transplant to the most severe cases where people are at risk of their life because you wouldn't put a child or a young adult on anti-rejection drugs per life for life because they would develop infection, organ toxicity, even cancer. The doctor says preclinical trials were very successful. The next step is getting FDA approval for human trials, which could begin within the next year. There's also some new research finding that some anti-inflammatory medications used to treat short-term pain may actually prolong the problem instead. Now, according to the report, pain resolution is an active biological process and that inflammation is really the body's natural response to injury and infection. Scientists say blocking that inflammation with drugs can lead to harder to treat issues in the long run. They say the findings should be followed up by some clinical trials directly comparing anti-inflammatory drugs to other painkillers that relieve aches and pains but don't disrupt the inflammation process. And another new study offering hope for early detection of pancreatic cancer. Doctors at Boston Medical Center found that gallstones could be an early warning sign. In their study, patients with an aggressive form of pancreatic cancer were six times more likely to have had gallstones within the year before the diagnosis. Researchers say this doesn't mean someone with gallstone disease is automatically going to get pancreatic cancer, but these patients should be closely monitored.